Now, of course, a little chillier today, but uh, we're in for a mild sort of weekend, and let's go to Bill for the latest on the temperature front. Yeah, back in the 40s, and uh, what you need to rem remember about Lake on Alaska, even though it's uh, not in the main channel of the Mississippi, you're still going to get some current uh, with the Black River and the Mississippi River, uh, the effects of that uh, moving through there. So, uh, yeah. 12 to 14 inches of ice, but with the current underneath, it really weakens that ice. So it is something to keep in mind. All right, uh, beautiful day in terms of sunshine today, but temperatures were colder, but just closer to where we should be for this time of year. 32 the high, 17 the low. Uh, averages are 31 and 12. 51, the record high, uh, set as recent as 2009. 32 below the record low, set way back in 1899. Currently, sunshine, 30 degrees out at the airport, still 32 here at the station. Uh, feels like 22 with a northwest breeze at about 5 to 10. Eau Claire, you're colder, 24 degrees with a wind chill factor of 16. South to southwest wind at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So, uh, again, it was colder today, but still not crazy cold or stupid cold or anything like that. That's uh, well up to the north and east up into eastern Canada. Uh, temperatures again in the upper 20s to around 30 degrees. Colder to the north and west though, low to mid 20s uh, for you folks. And about, uh, well, anywhere from 5 to 13 degrees colder right now than this time yesterday. And winds generally from the west at around 5 to 10, maybe 12 miles per hour. And that's causing some slight wind chills in the teens and lower 20s. Zone forecast showing lows tonight. Uh, chilly, but not overly cold for this time of year. Our average low is 12. We'll be about 10 degrees above that in La Crosse. Uh, lower 20s down to the south. And something to keep in mind, we'll probably hit these numbers around midnight or shortly thereafter and maybe even rise a few degrees as we head into the uh, morning hours. Skies are mainly clear across the region. In fact, looking upstream, uh, hardly any clouds there either. So uh, lots of sunshine in store for tomorrow. And we're going to get into a southwesterly wind flow, and that's going to help warm temperatures back above average. In fact, well above average for the weekend. Maybe some passing clouds on Sunday with that disturbance up in southern Canada. So all is quiet, clear sky tonight, and then tomorrow, lots of sunshine. But again, notice those southwesterly winds, a little breeze so that might make that uh, uh, high temperature in the low to mid 40s tomorrow feel a little bit chillier. Now, Sky Tracker may be overdoing the cloud cover just a bit, but uh, again, that's with that passing system to the north. Uh, some passing clouds, especially in our northern and uh, western communities during the day on Sunday. Otherwise, temperatures tomorrow back in the low to mid 40s. So again, back uh, well above average, low to mid 40s will be common in our southern zones, central zones as well, and even up into uh, Eau Claire in the Chippewa Valley, right around 40 to 42 degrees for afternoon highs. So for tonight, clear skies, uh, chilly, but not overly cold, uh, 22 for the low, 44 tomorrow with lots of sunshine. Again, that southwesterly breeze will make that number feel a bit chillier than that, and we're going to stay in the low to mid 40s right through the middle of next week. Now I'm tracking two separate storm system, one that could bring mainly rain showers uh, on Valentine's Day, especially later in the day and into Tuesday night. Just a small chance of showers lingering on Wednesday. And then Thursday is looking a little bit more interesting in terms of the uh, chance for some snow and perhaps some accumulating snow on Thursday with breezy and colder conditions. That's still six days out there, so uh, plenty of uh, wiggle room, but just something to monitor as we head into next week. All right. Thanks very much, Bill. Okay.